Pirates taking on the Reds. Pittsburgh's Jeff Locke hasn't pitched since July 8th, returning after back tightness, trying to stop a red sweep. Meanwhile, Homer Bailey pitching for the first time at home since his no-hitter facing Garrett Jones in the second. There's a high drive to right center field on cue. He says clear the deck, cannonball coming. G.I. Jones cranks his 10th, and it's 1-0 Bucks in the second. KDKA with the call. Locke getting the early lead, and he was sharp in the third. He strikes out Bailey swinging. And two batters later, Chris Heisey goes down swinging. And then in the fourth, Brandon Phillips strikes out on a foul tip. Locke giving up only one hit and five Ks through four. Top five, Bailey settling down after the early homer. Jordy Mercer goes down swinging. Then he fans Locke, nine Ks through five for Bailey. Bottom of the fifth, after two walks and a sacrifice, put runners on second and third with two outs and Shinsu Chu batting. Locke uncorks the wild pitch. Zach Kozart comes in to score, and the game is all tied up at one. Later in Chu's at bat, he pops up to third, and Pedro Alvarez makes the catch to end the inning. Locke goes six, giving up only one hit and one run with six strikeouts. Top seven, Bailey in trouble with a runner on second, facing Jordy Mercer. This ball bounced, headed up the middle, and threw a base hit. Michael McHenry headed to the plate. He will score, and there it is. A big hit with a man in scoring position delivered by Jordy Mercer in the seventh, and the Pirates lead 2-1. to one. KDKA with the call once again. Two batters later, Jose Tabata with an RBI single, scoring Mercer, and the Pirates take a 3-1 lead. Bailey goes six and a third, seven hits, three runs, and a career-high 12 strikeouts. Bottom of the eighth, Mark Melanson on in relief, in some trouble with the bases loaded and no one out. Joey Votto grounds into the 3-6-1 double play, so there's two outs in the inning, but a run comes in to score, and it's a 3-2 game. Next batter, Brandon Phillips, and he grounds out to short to end the inning. Melanson wiggles out of trouble. Bottom of the ninth, Jason Grilly on to shut the door. Tying run on first, and Devin Mezzarocco pops out to Barmas to end it. Pirates hang on to win 3-2. Grilly really picks up his NL leading 30th save of the year. Locke gets the win, moving to 9-2. The win snaps a three-game losing streak for Pittsburgh, and Shinsu Chu extended his career-best hit streak to 15 games.